Yo, what's up guys and welcome back to a brand new video here on my channel and today's video I want to tell you guys why you should maybe utilize the performance mode actually in chapter 3 even though I said in previous videos that DirectX 12 theoretically gives you more FPS and less input delay DirectX 12 only gives you actually additional FPS if you have at least a medium to high-end gaming PC, you know, something which is like ready for competitive Fortnite. I'm talking about anything above a GTX 1650, you know, should really utilize DirectX 12. But since so many people ask me, especially on like low-end PCs, laptops, or like, I don't know, even integrated graphics, which game mode they should utilize, of course guys, if you're running a low-end PC, please utilize the performance mode. The rendering technology on DirectX 12 is way too sharp for low-end PCs, so therefore guys you can see actually right now in the background some gameplay recorded on an RX 560 which is like more on the low end lineup of the 500 AMD series cards and you can see we get beautiful 144 FPS plus sometimes even like 200 FPS so therefore you should definitely utilize the performance mode by the way huge, huge shout out for the gameplay I'm gonna leave both channels in the description who provided me with this and I also did so many benchmarks myself guys already with a GTX 1060 and I gotta say especially on these weaker cards I don't want to call them like super low end because integrated graphics are even more low end than something like RX 560 you know what I'm saying boys but if you're like running a weaker system definitely still go for the performance mode guys and if you're running anything like above, uh, I don't know, GTX 1060, 1650, something like that in this area, guys, you should consider testing out DirectX 12. But here personally, guys, on my mid to high end PC system, you know, with RTX 2070 and Horizon 7, I can definitely say, guys, if you have some sort of like competitive setup, you should definitely utilize DirectX 12 because it just gives you in the long term way more consistent FPS than actually the performance modes and it's still really broken. But as mentioned, uh, low-end PCs can't really handle DirectX 12, so therefore still utilize please the performance mode. You can also see in the background now some gameplay in a second here with a 1030, guys. And you can see that the FPS are really smooth. And a 1030 is super low-end, you know. It's just barely better than some integrated Vega graphics on the Ryzen side. So therefore, guys, please utilize the performance mode. So many people asked me on stream, so therefore I just thought I made another dedicated video explaining this. And yeah, I hope this helped you guys out so far with the basic information here, basic knowledge. And by the way, streaming super often actually on my YouTube. So therefore, if you have any more questions, you can also ask me live on stream. And I hope I just helped you guys out a little bit more. So as mentioned again, one more time, guys, if you're running a low end PC system, integrated graphics, a laptop, something like that, guys, please utilize still the performance mode. It may still give you more FPS in the long run. And only if you have a somehow semi decent PC rig, you know, which is like a little bit capable of gaming I would say something as mentioned from like a GTX 1060 above you should consider DirectX 12 because that one is in my opinion still the best one for competitive gaming as of right now I did a bunch of benchmarks guys on a GTX 970 on my RTX 2070 on a 3080 I got provided a benchmark and I can only say DirectX 12 is your main goal guys if you want to go for a competitive setup and I want to say guys DirectX 12 is the best game rendering mode for the best competitive Fortnite settings in chapter 3 but it only really makes sense if you have a capable setup of running DirectX 12 properly. That's the main feature, guys. And with that said, we're pretty much done here. I hope I helped you out. And if you still have any more questions, feel free to ask me them down in the comment section below. I try to answer as many as possible. And with that said, have a great day, have a great night, whenever you're watching this. And until next time, stay awesome. I'm out. Peace. That shit too light. Before, come get inside. Diamond, Gucci, Lee,